remember back in the days when men used to wear mixed matched socks? Usually it happened with the blacks and the navy blues. And they just couldn't see that they were two different colors. Well, since then, the sock game has increased tremendously. 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 So, you know what we're going to talk about today? Socks. Okay? Okay. Okay. Hey, happy Monday. I'm CLM2 for Style with Power, the channel that helps empower men through style. And if you're interested in videos that's going to help men with empowerment, help men with fashion, help men with style, and help men with mindset, well, this is the channel for you. So don't forget to go down, hit that subscribe button, and hit the little bell so you'll know every time we upload a video. How big is the sock game? Well, according to CNBC market research, the U.S. market for socks is expected to reach $11.6 billion by 2023. That's billion with a B. So who would ever have thought that socks would get so popular? But they have so many different types of socks. They have athletic socks. They have dress socks. They have uh, designer socks, they have women's socks, men's socks, children's socks, right? All types of socks. And this industry has just exploded over the last few years. So if anybody's thinking about getting into uh, an industry that's still, still untapped or getting into uh, investment in an industry, you may want to think about the sock game. So today what I did is I bought out some of my socks because when I buy socks, I usually try to buy socks that's going to wow individuals. And I try to match my socks with my ties. Usually my socks will match with my ties or it will match with a shirt. But most of the time I try to match my socks with ties. So I bought a few of my socks here. I'm just gonna show you a few of the colors that I have. And I say to you men out there, you definitely want to go out there and get yourself some nice socks. So here's one of my favorite. Um, I like this one. It's the black gray and the purple sock. Really, really nice. Have kind of that argyle look to it. So I like that I have a tie this color. I have a tie all these colors. It has a little pink in there also. So you can actually throw in the pink tie with this also. Right? Really, really nice. Um, here's another pink and blue. Pink and navy blue. I like got the stripes in there. The pink comes out really, really strong when I wear this sock here. So I definitely wear this with a pink tie, a pink pocket square. This makes it look really, really nice. This one right here, uh, a greenish, bluish, really nice. And um, I don't have a green tie this color, but I'm definitely gonna go out and look to purchase a green tie this color. So that would definitely bring this, this sock out. Really, really nice. I can wear this with a nice blue suit. Uh, one of my favorite socks that I usually always wear, of course, is my Power Red. You know, as you can see, um, I love the red color. Red is in my logo. You know, so red is all over my page. Right? So I love the red. So I usually don't wear, um, when I wear the red color, I usually don't wear a mixture of red. I like to wear the bright red. So this comes out. So as I'm walking down the street or I sit down and cross my legs, this red will just knock your socks off. Oh, no pun intended. Knock you right in the head. You see that red, that red is nice and bright. Now, you can also get these specialty socks. I went out and bought these socks. Well, it was a gift to me. Someone gifted me these socks. And guess what? It had my initials on it, CLM, which is great. I said, wow, that's nice. So I'm quite sure that you can go out there and get your, your, uh, your initials on your socks. This is nice. I just didn't understand why they only put it on one sock. They don't have it on the other sock. They just have it on one side. So uh, you definitely want to make sure that if you're out there making socks, you want to put the initials on both socks, not just one. But I love these socks. I got three pair of these. This is the blue one. I got one uh, in black and gray, and I have one, uh, I believe, in navy blue. This is really nice. Now. This one is kind of a Christmassy look, you know. So I got this here in winter time and it's kind of a Christmassy look. Um, strange mixture of colors. It has a little green in there. Um, of course.
course it has the blue, light blue. All right, so I wear this one every now and then. Don't wear this much, don't wear this one as much, but what I will do is go out and get a nice tie that will match this, and then I'll wear this one a little bit more. This is a sock I wear often. I have a tie that's kind of the same pattern, so I wear this sock pretty often. Usually wear it with my blue suits. I have a sky blue, a navy blue suit, and I wear this one all the time. As you can see, it has a different colors in it, different blues are in here, so this one I like to wear a lot of time. And then the Rust family, right? I have this one here. This is blue and rust, so I have the rust shoes. I have the rust tie, rust belt, right? So this is a great uh, color match with that and of course it has a blue in there so you would have a nice navy blue suit and it has a gray up top you can wear it with a gray suit this is pretty nice so sock game sock game is happening women love to see men with a nice sock game so men don't be afraid to go out there and put on some socks that's going to make your outfit look great and of course you know what I'm going to do I'm going to put a link in the description of where you can buy yourself some nice socks you can go there you can check you can check out the socks and um, get yourself some nice pair of socks don't be afraid to uh, be experimental and make things happen and I tell you the sock game will definitely make your outfits absolutely stand out